A beam splitter mirror, also known as a teleprompter mirror, is a high transparency mirror that allows flawless clarity while providing a crisp reflection of text. The reflective side has a tint-free mirror coating and the back side has an anti-reflective coating to prevent a double image seen in cheap teleprompter glass known as ghosting. Hey everyone, I'm Hannah with Two Way Mirrors. Every week, we bring you new videos to share our experience in manufacturing optical glass and mirrors. Hit that subscribe button to stay tuned to our latest guides and take a moment right now to smash that like button for the YouTube algorithm. In this guide, I'm going to take you through how to use a beam splitter mirror, what makes it unique from a two-way mirror, and all of the features and benefits of using it. I've also posted complete step-by-step -step instructions down below on how you can make a professional teleprompter using easily found parts. If you're looking to make a high quality teleprompter and want to save a ton of time on your project, you're going to love this. Why use a beam splitter mirror? A lot of people make the mistake of using regular glass or acrylic for their teleprompter. To a first time teleprompter builder, this can seem like saving and money but the result has a dim reflection and an annoying double image. Using a more reflective mirror, such as a two-way mirror or window film, will be too dark to record through. That's the benefit of using a dielectric beam splitter mirror. It provides a high reflection without tinting on the glass. An optical grade beam splitter mirror is created in a vacuum chamber by dipping large sheets of low iron glass into a solution of dielectric filters, which is baked on for a permanent highly durable bond. The dielectric mirror allows a precise percentage of the light to pass through while reflecting the remainder. Here are the answers to questions we often get which will help you choose the best mirror for your project. The best level of transparency to order. 30R70T stands for 30% reflective and 70% transparent. 40R and 60T is slightly more reflective while still offering great tint-free transparency for the camera. Most clients choose 40R and 60T for the best of both worlds, but we offer both options to accommodate manufacturers and enthusiasts seeking a certain specification for their units. Best thickness to choose. Optically, the different thicknesses are nearly the same. Three millimeter is about half as strong as four millimeter. So it's good for applications where you're trying to fit the glass into a tight groove, an existing teleprompter you already own, or where you need a lightweight mirror. Four millimeter is stronger, so that's what many clients order. Two millimeter is a specialty beam splitter for teleprompter manufacturers, engineers, and scientists. Standard versus rounded corners. Standard corners are ideal for the best price and going in a frame. Rounded corners offer a stylistic advantage when the edges are exposed and avoid getting snagged on clothing in a presidential teleprompter setup. Okay, that takes you through the beam splitter mirror guide. I've left you all the information down below in our step-by-step -step DIY guide, which goes into a ton of detail about every part you'll need and how to use it. You can also check out our website, twowaymirrors.com, for free voice activated teleprompter software. If you have any questions, leave a comment below or shoot us an email. Until next time, I'm Hannah with Two Way Mirrors and I'll see you in my next video.